Two county supervisors are calling on San Diego to clean up its act when it comes to our air. Today, Nathan Fletcher and Greg Cox launched a new Clean Air for All campaign. Here's KPBS reporter Matt Hoffman. Barrio Logan, National City, San Ysidro are severely impacted by air quality issues. Trucks are constantly rumbling through San Diego County South Bay, often heading to the ports. The terminal facilities uh, generated a lot of uh, air pollution because of the heavy equipment. Some port tenants have already started investing in electric and lower emission vehicles. But county officials say more needs to be done. When you look at the simple reality that a child in Barrio Logan is eight times more likely to have asthma than a child in La Jolla, uh, I believe morally wrong. County staff is allocating $28 million of state funds to businesses, government agencies, and nonprofits so that they can swap out polluting machinery for electric and low carbon options. This is an example of a higher emission vehicle. The county's hoping this money will help get trucks like this off the road and replace them with lower emission vehicles. $28 million alone is not going to do it, but it is a positive step in the right direction. The county says the money will first go to areas that need it the most, like Sherman Heights, Barrio Logan, and Portside areas. Communities that have the dirtiest air, communities that historically have been disadvantaged and left behind. And the money isn't just for vehicles. Trucking, freight equipment, off-road equipment, uh, equipment rental companies, agricultural companies, marine uh, and repair businesses, locomotive, K-12 through schools. The county is accepting proposals now and will make final decisions by the fall.